up, you guys, and welcome back to another Every Freaking Wednesday. Anyways, it's the Wednesday before Valentine's Day, so I guess we have to make one of those corny-ass Valentine videos. Anyways, let's just get right into it. If this is your first time here, go ahead and click the big red subscribe button and go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up because I promise you're going to love it. And while you're at it, go ahead and click the post notification bell so you get notified every time we upload a brand new video. And after you're done watching this one, you can go back and watch all the other videos that we have because we have a lot. We have a little variety, all right? Sometimes we spill the tea. Ew, I hate that. Okay. What are we doing today? All right. So like I said, we're making a Valentine's Day themed video because well content i for one am not very fond of valentine's day i mean it's all right do you like valentine's day not really yeah this is why we got married our shared hatred of valentine's day no we don't hate it it's just for me halloween is more romantic than valentine's day so what's your beef with valentine's day i don't care well it's not a holiday for dudes anyway I've heard that before. That's tea. Anyways, we're not going to get into being down in the dumps on Valentine's Day. You get it. We're not fans, but we're doing it because we're YouTube whores. I found a little quiz. Remember those corny little quizzes you used to find in magazines? Yeah, that's what we're doing. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> so if you guys want to uh, do this quiz with your significant other or if you're single and you want to do the quiz with your imaginary significant other no judgment here i will link uh the test down below and let us know what your results are come back and leave us a comment let us know what type of couple you are or uh come find us on twitter or all of our other social media okay so the name of the quiz is valentine's day quiz what type of couple are you i hate it already I hate it. Why are we doing this? Okay, so we're just gonna go through this really quickly, and by the end of it, maybe you know a little bit more about us as a couple, because we're so cute. Look at him. He's so handsome. Okay, anyways, all right, so please keep a pen and paper. We have to have school supplies? Okay. One moment. I think it's like 10 questions. Let me make sure, because I, you look, look. I'm the type of person I don't like to try very hard. Yeah, so there's 10 questions. If you don't feel like going online and finding the quiz, I'll put the questions right down here for you guys. Okay, so moving right along. Okay, so the instructions read, please keep a pen and paper ready to take this Valentine's Day special couple quiz. Unless your sharp memory has been fed enough almonds for the day. <laughs> yes, you have to go all the way down to see the A-N-S-W-E-R. <clears throat> okay, <laughs> moving on. All right, so question number one. What do people say when they see you guys together? A, oh, you look so much in love with each other. I'm jealous. B, you both are always busy talking and meeting other people at a party. And C, you two look like you are having fun, right from giggling to mocking others. So A, B, or C, what, what would you say? I guess C, I'll just go C. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Okay, I can agree with that. Question number two. How often do you say, I love you to each other? A, we say it over and over again. It's so cute. B, it's a cliche. We are grownups now. Or C, Although it's funny, but then we argue about who loves the other more. Honestly, we don't believe it matters. I don't know. I guess B, I guess. I don't know. That's all thread of the corner. B is kind of rude. No, it's not. Oh, it's so mean. You say it, but we don't say it over and over. I do! No, you don't. I do. I do. I just don't. What? And that's so mean. It's like, it's cliche. We're grown-ups. I'm not telling. But we do say yeah, it. It is cliche. B is... Oh. To say it over and over again? No, but this is implying that we don't say it anymore. We do say it. We say it a lot. So then it's not me. I guess they did. Well, they could have gave good answers. You're mean. I don't, I don't like you. Well, I mean, we don't argue about who... 
don't do okay, that. well then I guess it is C because you just said we don't believe it matters. So it doesn't matter, right? No, I'm not, I'm not saying it don't matter to stay it, but we don't, I mean. Yeah, but the whole thing is for C, it says, although it's funny, but then we argue about who loves the other more. Yeah. Honestly, we don't believe it matters. Yeah, C, shut up. Number three. Oh, sorry, that was question number three. Number two, let me go back. What would you guys most likely be doing on a date? A, any place works for us as long as it's just the two of us. B, grab a quick and quiet meal. We're short of conversations now. C, clubbing, bowling, go-karting. We always choose a fun place with lots of activities. What was that again? Any place works for us as long as it's just the two of us. Yeah, let's go with that yeah, because we do anything. I mean, sometimes we do lots of fun activities, but then other times we're just like, I mean, we could have a date night on the couch. So this is just two of us. Sorry, mix up two and three. I'm got you guys can figure it out. It's fine. It's whatever. And I mean, it doesn't really have to be in order. Anyway, no, 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 no. But anyways, okay, four. Do you both argue? A, argue, nah, that's a big no in our relationship. B, we are tired of arguing and prefer ignorance now. C, we do, but end up talking to each other and find a common ground. That one. C, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Five, how often do you compliment each other? A, all the time and it's inevitable. B, not really, where's the time, yawn. Or C, it's not required. We know we are the best. Corny. It's A. It is A. You do it all the time. I know I do it all the time. All right, six. If you were stuck on an island, what would you do? A, we'll build sandcastles with our names on them. On second thought, we might end up living at that island. B, scream. Light a fire to alert some ships that hopefully are sailing somewhere on the sea. C, we'll play basketball, swim around, and look out for food. C. T. Almost done, guys. Almost done. Almost done. Seven. If one of you is away, how often do you call each other? A, it's a rule to always stay connected wherever we go. We just can't afford to lose contact. B, Call like really only if I can't find my pair of socks in the drawer and see we often call or text each other to distress or to share a good joke. I would say C. Mm -hmm. Eight children getting down to the wire here. A movie you would like to watch together. A notebook. Mm, man, they lost when they said the notebook. I ain't watching that show. We will discuss this. Born moving. We will discuss this later. <laughs> Don't watch it that. We will discuss this. Mm -mm. B, Godfather. Mm -hmm. C, Dumb and Dumber. Well, either one of those two. Either one of those two. Not A. Well, Dumb and Dumber then. I mean, I would prefer a notebook, but I, I'm, I don't really want to watch The Godfather. We said together. Oh my, that. you don't want to watch Dumb and Dumber? No, absolutely, but I'm saying either one of the B, I, I like Godfather and I like Dumb and Dumber. All right, well, I, I mean, I guess I could go for Godfather. Well, no, nah, Dumb and Dumber. I don't see you watching that. <laughs> I just, I, I didn't I know. I am also hip. I'm hip, I'm old. I know, but I'm cool, because I don't watch the Godfather. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Number three. I mean, either one is fun. I like either one, too. I don't know, pick one. I'm Pixie. But then people won't think I'm cool. It's Pixie. I mean, I'm goofy. Look, I could go for the Godfather, but I'm thinking, like, more like, you know? I don't know what I'm saying. You just watched that movie recently, anyway. Eight, see? Mm-hmm. Okay. Nine. How similar are your likes and dislikes? A, 2020. We can always change to suit each other. B, we don't, re we don't remember now. Or C, quite similar. Quite similar. Yeah. Can anybody else predict the type of couple that each answer is by now? That's beside the point. It was that. And last one, guys. Ten. Ten. I'm not that. 
What does Valentine's Day mean? Oh. Sorry. What does Valentine's Day mean to you? You know, on my grill, son. Son? I don't know. Sorry, camera died. Actually, storage was full, but whatever. Same difference. A. Every day is Valentine's Day for us. B. A marketing gimmick which is meant to yeah. lure people to spend without yeah. using their brains. Yeah. Or C. Doesn't matter. We just get another reason to plan a house party with friends. B. What is? Every day is Valentine's Day. <laughs> Every day. It's still B. A. A. It is A. For you, but B, I think it's B. That's how I look at Valentine's Day. Every day is my Valentine's Day. It is for you. We mean for me, it's not for you. No. Am I not a Valentine? Yeah, you are. I just don't like Valentine's Day. Yeah, but every day is Valentine's Day with me, right? Yeah. See, he does love me. A. Yeah. We can put A. Thank you. And the results are. At this point, you're going to count up how many of each letter that you have, and then it has a result for each one. I'm not going to read through every one because I don't care enough. So I'm going to, we're going to add up what letter we have the most, and we're going to read our results. If you want the other results, the link is down below for you to go take your own quiz for yourself. The results are in. We have seven C's, no D's, three A's, okay? Sounds like some of your report cards. So let's read what mostly C's says. All right, so the results were mostly C's. The best friends couple. Aw, good to know that you both understand each other so well and consider it fortunate of having found a best friend for life. Okay, so here's the thing. We call ourselves children. So the fact that they're implying, okay, you guys are best friends, but like be more grown up. I mean, that's us. That's why we got married, because we're both children. Mm -hmm. Wow, so, you know, the corny little quince does know us after all. Are we gonna go out and do like romantic dinner stuff? Probably not, not really us. Occasionally, but we're not mature enough for that. A couple times we did it and we both it was kind of uncomfortable. We went to some like, we've gone to like really like fancy restaurants where you can't read the words on the menu. And I just don't like having to worry about what fork I'm supposed to be using. I appreciate the gesture though. I'm glad he thought that I was that high class that that's what I wanted to do, that he thought I was bougie and I had to be royal. And I'm like, we can just go get a burger. <laughs> Very fine with that. Anyway, so yeah, we are the mostly sees the best friends couple and i'm okay with that yeah, that's cool hmm. anyways that's it for our every bigger wednesday video we hope you have a happy valentine's day if you're not into valentine's day then we're right there with you if you're single who cares valentine's day is only 24 hours you're single today you'll be single tomorrow and the day after so it yeah it doesn't matter so and people who have Valentine's, who are really big in Valentine's Day, and you have single friends and relatives, don't be an asshole, because really, honestly, most people don't give a damn. <laughs> All right, so um, that's it. If you haven't already done so, go ahead and click that big red subscribe button and give this video a big thumbs up. If you took the quiz or if you're going to, please leave us a comment down below and let us know your results. Go ahead and come find us on all of our other social media. This one has a podcast, so go listen and check it out. It's kind of cool. He's been doing sports, but he's about to get into some tea. You don't want to miss the tea, honey, honey, honey. Anyways, okay, so um, we're going to go and pretend like uh, taking this quiz didn't kill a little piece of us. Just kidding. Often I like corny stuff, but it's something about Valentine's Day. It's just um, not our not our gig, not our gig. Anyways, we love you very much, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye bye. Woo. Is that how they talking, or is that just you doing that? Oh, am I annoying? No.